So if we have 1,000 parties without any, the, any of the political parties desiring to give the country what it demands, we are not making any headway. And so as far as I'm concerned, it is not the restriction of party that matters. And of course, again, on a second note, if we have 1,000 parties, we know there are other minor, minor parties that are not major. This is Nigeria. And you know, Nigeria, oh, the problem we have is not party. It's the humans in the party. Because if the party can have persons that have interests of the public, it will deliver. But the issue is that not registering hundreds or millions of political parties, but who has the mind to deliver this nation that is decaying. Nigeria is decaying every blessed day. But for me, I believe uh, that you kind of reduce it probably to two or three parties. should be enough. So that uh, people, who, people who have uh, kind of chances, options to pick. Yeah, I think that's the best. Instead of uh, Nazi parties, under parties and, uh, and so on. I think these parties that are being introduced, they should give them a chance. Because everybody needs a chance as well. Just like the PDP, the APC, they have gotten their chance. Still nothing is coming out from the country. But like this new party are being introduced, they should give them a chance to prove themselves of what they can do for the country. Well, for me, seeing it as, I'm seeing it that it will not help the situation of the country. Being, having about it something political parties to me. So I don't, want, I don't know what is their own... Uh, aim and objective by registering about it something political parties by now. It is not politically wise. Nigeria is at least three, 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 Nigerian map stand on three trapezoidal uh, stands. And on that ground, they are only having three parties, which is P, uh, APC, PDP, ABGA. Personally, it's not what Nigeria needs now. Nigeria needs, we wouldn't have to be focused on how to make good living for people, for masses, to get, what they, to get their daily bread. Just like as we are here now, look at people moving around. Some of them don't even know the name of the parties. So if you ask Nigerian man, average Nigerian now, which party do we have in Nigeria? Well, how years they can count out of that 91? They can only count three or five parties. The rest are just story. What is PDP, APC? Maybe the next you can hear a Labour Party. That is all. If INEC should go on I mean, sensitization uh, campaign, the national orientation also should do their own. Let them do the campaign right all over Nigeria and let all Nigerians be aware what political parties are really involved. You will see many of them on that day, but we only have two political parties that are, that are making noise in Nigeria. That is the, SD, I mean the PDP and the, AC, and, and, the, and the APC. That is the two political parties we know for now. So why are you creating more political parties? You are calling your friends to come and eat the buffet because Nigeria is a buffet. Everybody is coming to eat the national cake. I am not and will never be in support of INEC adding additional 23 parties. What are we doing with 90 something part, 90 parties in Nigeria? The 63 parties that we have on ground, how well have we utilized them? It is scandalous. What are we doing with 90 political parties when we have just less than four existing political parties uh, practically? On paper, we have 90. Practically, we have, and in reality, we have just four political parties in this country. So I don't, I don't, I don't see the wisdom. It's scandalous. So the solution is not adding 23 poli extra 23 political parties. It's for us to come together, converging, convening a, a meeting which will be independent from political parties. We should remove aggression, transference of aggression to each other and come together to bring an elastic solution to what will stem, what will bring to a stoppage the killings of innocent Nigerians.